Falun Dafa, also known as Falun Gong, is an advanced self-cultivation practice that improves mental and physical wellness through physical exercises and the development of one's character. In China, cultivation practices have a history of thousands of years and form the spiritual foundation of Chinese civilization. In 1992, Falun Dafa was introduced to the public by Master Li Hong Zhu. The practice quickly spread because of its profound principles and proven health benefits. By 1999, with over 100 million practitioners, Falun Dafa had grown to become the largest practice of its kind in China and around the world. Traditional Chinese medicine focuses on energy channels and believes that the health of the body is related to the health of the mind. Falun Dafa cultivates mind and body simultaneously, improving the body's natural immunity. I had a very, very bad immune system. I was sick all the time. And I came to the practice for spiritual reasons, but I immediately stopped getting sick. I kept thinking, why am I not getting sick? I kept saying, what's wrong? As a matter of fact, I go to parties now, and um, they used to say, oh, give the sick babies to Jeannie. She never gets sick. <laughs> I feel an energy in my body that's very subtle and hard to describe, but it feels very good. I could have very little sleep and I'll feel awakened, but not like a coffee energetic, like a very calm and collected energy. And that one hour it can feel like a day, and then I'm refreshed and, and ready to go. But before I practice Falun Gong, when I got scolded by my boss or supervisor, I was very annoyed and immediately I would complain about others, you know, or felt it wasn't fair. But after I started practicing, the biggest lesson I learned was looking inside and always find something to improve within myself. If I didn't like something that another person did, I would think about, oh, I don't like that. I don't like that that person does that. And I realized that it was having a direct effect on my health by having that bad thought about that person. And as soon as I realized that, I changed my thinking so that I wouldn't think about what things I didn't like or liked about other people and more just how I should be responsible to being a good person and controlling my thinking and quieting my thinking. And then the headaches went away. The first time I heard about Falun Dafa was actually when I was 12 years old. At the time, I was going through a rebellious stage. I barely talked to my parents. You know, I come home, slam the door. Meditation taught me to look within. I started talking to my parents more. I started respecting them more. So my mother was very happy because, you know, she, it's like she got her son back. Zhiwizhi,全世界中医西医都没有办法治疗。一九九八年二月份,我一位在大陆的朋友过来了一份信,他告诉我,法隆大法的修炼才是真正的正法修炼,他可以是人心灵生活,身体健康,交工点,开始
is the greatest challenge of my life, actually. You would think it's so simple, but you know, therein lies the challenge. But everybody else around you feels it, you know, because you, you become lighter, you become, you smile a lot more, um, and you become much more genuine. It was like I was always searching for something, and it's so easy to think that what we're searching for is outside, whether it's money or clothes or beauty or whatever. And Falun Dafa just provided me with an inner peace that I just feel like whatever happens around me, I'm fine. Like I have these values and principles that I can follow. It's just like a sense of, not security, but inner security and a sense of, of calm and peace, which I didn't have before. <laughs>